So this is how you go live on Facebook new page experience. So when you are in your page, you look at the top part of the page and you will find room, group and live. So you click on live. So you can choose to do a, uh, sorry, you can choose to do a live audio and then uh, a video broadcast. So you choose the video broadcast and you click on next. So from here, you can see uh, the camera has been opened. So with the first button at the down at the bottom here, you can see the link. So you can choose to add links to um, your broadcast. Yes, and these links will be displayed to the viewers. With the second button, I think it's a description. And also the third button, the groups you like to uh, share the live width so let's check if let me see i don't think there are any groups available so if you have any groups you like to share the broadcast with click on that and then so with the fourth button here this is what you call cross posting cross posting so you can only cross post to pages that have approved your page so if you select a page that hasn't approved a cross posting relationship with your page then you will receive a notification to what approve it so you can select or or you choose uh the ones you like to do the cross posting with and with this cross posting it's like um joining someone to the live like yeah sharing a live video with somebody so that's uh the function of that you can switch camera yes can switch the camera with this particular button that is the back and front and also you can use filters as well you can use filters as well so come to talk of the last button here when you click on that uh, I think there are also additional features over here so let me talk about the advanced settings you can uh, allow viewers to rewind when you turn this on click on done and that is all and also if you want to limit the comments so you just click on the comments under settings and support so when you click on that you click on settings and then if you want to leave your followers to comment or people you followed to comment or any other thing you can just read through and then you select what you um you want yes so if you want to do a test broadcast as well you can just turn this on and then you start your test so let's click on start test and then you see how it goes so this is just a, a test broadcast yes after you are done with your settings this is not actually broadcasting things but just a test broadcast so you just have to click on finish when done So I think that is it. This is just test. So just click on delete and that is all. So after you are done with all your settings, you just click on go live and it will start. So that is it.